What's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to set up your brand new Deeper Connect Pico and use it as a repeater when you're at that coffee shop, in the hotel, at the bar, anywhere that there's Wi-Fi. You'll be able to connect using a decentralized VPN and ensure all of your traffic is protected, all of your traffic is secured. Now if you don't know about a VPN, this is sort of like a peer-to-peer -peer VPN service. There are no logs because everything is stored on device itself. Deeper Connect does not have any servers, so if you worry about logging, don't worry about logging with Deeper Connect because that does not happen. This is a low cost VPN because once you buy it, there's no monthly fee, no fees whatsoever. Just buy the device and you can and you can unlock the web. You can unlock geo restricted content all over the world thanks to using this portable device. Now let's go in. I'm going to show you how to set up as a wireless repeater and then I'm going to tell you a little bit more about Pico and for a full review, check my link down below or this card that's going to pop up because I went in depth about more about this device. So let's just go ahead and set up together as a wireless repeater. Before I set this up as a wireless repeater and use my laptop how to show you how to do it, it comes with some ethernet cables as well. You'll notice it has USB-C ports just about everywhere on this device. So if you want whole home protection, just put this right after your modem and before your router and all of your traffic is going to be encrypted. All of your traffic is going to be secure. All of your internet traffic is going to be unlocked no matter where you want to surf from the world. This is a great decentralized VPN again because you're going to unlock geo restrictions. You can watch BBC, you can watch The Zone, you can watch Netflix from whatever country or region you want to. Again, because it doesn't have servers, the IP addresses are shared from actual people like you and me. So there's no chance that these major players are gonna be able to block those IP addresses like they do if you're using a commercial VPN, such as Nord, such as TorGuard, or any of those services. They have a pool of IP addresses, and Netflix ain't dumb. They know exactly which IP addresses belong to a VPN, and they'll block you right away. But with a decentralized VPN with Deeper Connect products, you're always gonna have an IP address that works, and I've been using this for about a month, and I can tell you, I stream all day, every day, from just about anywhere that I want. So if you want whole home protection, just connect it before your router and after your modem, and that's one way to do it. But if you're out and about and you did purchase this extra Wi-Fi dongle, you can use this anywhere you are, such as a coffee shop, at the hotel, and you can just repeat any network, but ensure that all of your traffic is connected. So first, what you want to do is go ahead and plug in the USB-C cable to give this some power. Then I'm going to show you on my laptop how to set it up. The first thing that you want to do is go ahead and look for the Pico SSID. And the default password is I love deeper. So go ahead and put I love deeper into the Pico Wi-Fi connection. Next, what you want to do is log into the control panel. And that address is 168.192.1.1. Once you do that, you'll be logged into the administration panel. And the default password, once again, is admin admin. Once you log into the control panel, you can change the SSID of Pico and the Wi-Fi password. And then you'll see all available Wi-Fi networks right in this panel here. And then you can click on scan if you don't see the one that you want to. Once you find the Wi-Fi network that you want to repeat, that you want to connect to, click on it, enter in the password. Now, if it's an open Wi-Fi, you just be able to click on it and it should work right away. Click on connect. It's going to connect to the Wi-Fi network. And that's everything you have to do to connect to a network. And then you'll see this graphic on the top, which explains exactly how you're connected. So I have devices connected, going through Pico, encrypting all of my data, going to nodes all over the world, blocking ads and all that good stuff. And that gives me access to the internet. So now if you want to connect another device, all you have to do is search for Pico or whatever SSID you created. And you're going to be able to log in again using the Pico device, but it's routing all of your internet traffic to whatever Wi-Fi network you connected to, such as Wi-Fi at Starbucks or wherever you are. So you are connecting through Pico, which is rerouting your network traffic through whatever Wi-Fi network you are connected to. And that's basically it, guys. I hope this has helped. I know there was a lot of confusion about exactly how to connect this in wireless mode. This is all you need. This is all you need by your laptop. This is all you need for your tablet when you're out and about. This is your own personal hotspot, if you will. But you do need to connect to an open or secured Wi-Fi network first. And you'll be able to repeat it, encrypt your data, block ads, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys in another video.